But check this out, y'all. I gotta go to the fucking doctor. They're gonna know the shit out of me. I ain't been to the doctor in like fucking. I swear to God, man. I ain't been to the doctor in like eight years. <laughs> I know that motherfucker gonna have all kind of shit to say about me. I ain't been to the doctor in almost a decade. And I'm about to scroll my fat ass into this doctor's office. And this nigga probably gonna be like, Sir, how are you alive at this point? I mean, I don't get it. And I'm gonna be like, my dude, I'm gonna walk in anomaly like Jesus Christ, you know. My my very existence is questionable, so you know, just just get on board with the program. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? But I'm about to go to this fucking cocksucking doctor real quick. You know. Ah, that's gonna piss me off so fucking bad too. Cause it's a free it's not not a free clinic, but it's it's, it's a clinic. It's not even like a real fucking doctor. It's like my insurance is such shit that I can either schedule at one of them fucking doctors off that take a long fucking time or I can go to like one of these wellness clinics. So I'm just gonna go to one of the clinics. And I didn't even schedule the shit, man. You know how you, you know, parents and shit, man. My parents, man. You know, my mom, anyway, that's what it was. It was my mom, man, because, <clears throat> you know, when I was younger, man, I fucking, I, I broke a, a bone. Like my upper back is called the scapula, and I broke that. And uh, I never got a clearance from any doctor to kind of work ever since then because of the injury, and I just kind of been ignoring that shit. But every now and then, I have like these chronic back pains. I'm just kind of like, it might be due to the fact that I need to fucking work out, or you know, what I mean, it might be due to the fact that I need to get some exercise in, and not due to the fact that I have a trapped nerve or some shit in my back that she seemed to think it is. So. She scheduled the shit. She talked to the girl. I'm sorry about that. She talked to the girl who I'm currently talking to right now. And she got that shit all in her head now. So I got to go to the doctor. Because if I want to get some pull, I got to do the right thing. So, you know. I got to go to the fucking doctor. So, fuck, man. Oh, this going to annoy the shit out of me. Because I, I know it's going to be some bullshit. I already know it's going to be that standard. Oh, Mr. Taylor, uh, have you checked your blood? Your blood? pressure and all this bullshit no nigga i haven't okay i don't give a fuck either as long as i don't feel sick i'm great i know that i know that's stupid logic okay i'm not saying that y'all shouldn't go to the doctor y'all probably should but i just don't give a fuck to be honest with you i do care about my health but i just don't really give a fuck to have some cock sucking doctor just all in my shit but uh <laughs> i'm gonna go inside this doctor's office man i'll let y'all know when i get there i'll show y'all what this motherfucker look like so here we go all right, y'all, that's the place right here. I'm actually kind of pissed off because it's like it's a bunch of fucking cars up in this bitch. And it's nothing else really to see, so I'm assuming everyone's up here at the concerted place. But, you know, for all I know, I could be wrong, but I think I'm right. We'll see in a minute. You know what I mean? Gotta get this physical done, so we'll see. I'll let you guys know how that shit go. I'm just not leaving the doctor's office, right? And it's like 1 o'clock. Yeah, all the cars that y'all had saw were up here. I guess everybody go to the wellness clinic now. What the fuck? That shit strange like a motherfucker, son. Like, yeah. I just go here because I don't want to go. I just thought about something too, though, man. You know, when you go get a physical, they gotta play with your dick. You know, I don't know if they do it to women. I don't know when you women when you get a physical. Um, sorry, I put on my seatbelt. I don't know if the doctor has to play around and get snatched or whatever. I don't know. But, you know, as a dude, the doctor has to play with your balls and penis. But I just often wonder. I know doctors have seen it all. I just often wonder, have a female doctor ever seen a, a dick that made her double take while she was examining this motherfucker? I just often wonder. Damn, my nigga. The fuck? I just often wonder, you know. Uh, that, that woman just made the widest turn possible. Now I'm about to get stuck in traffic. I was supposed to go somewhere else, but fuck that. I'm about to go home. Fuck that. This traffic just got real as shit. I'm about to go home. Fuck that. Yeah, I was going to ride out to this tattoo shop and show you guys a tattoo shop, but fuck that. Fuck that. <laughs> Look at this traffic, man. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Y'all can see that shit. Then I'm about to be stuck in in a second. Fuck that, man. I'm about to go home. Fuck this. Fuck this shit. Oh, 
Jones. He let me out. I appreciate it, homie. Shit, yeah, buddy. There's some nice ass people in the world, y'all. Especially living down south. But yeah, man, a doctor had to play with my balls and, and penis. It's never. I don't. I don't give a fuck. Like how much pussy you get, it's never. You're never ready for that. When the doctor's like, all right, pull your pants down. Because it's just so fucking technical and forceful. Like, that's the equivalent. I mean, okay, before I say this, I don't mean that shit literally. But I'm saying, like, if, like, fuck, I'm not even going to say it. Fuck it. But that shit is just, it's, it's weird to me. It's strange as hell. Because I ain't been to a doctor in years, man. Like I said, I ain't been to a doctor in a long ass time. And it's funny because they kept talking about my blood pressure. Which I'm just like, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's how I'm overweight. You know what I'm saying? I'm overweight. I weigh right now. I I know I'm not supposed to be weighing this much, though, man. I know I'm not. I weighed myself the other day. I'm 247. I know fucking well I'm not supposed to weigh that much. I'm only I'm 5'11 and a half. Like you know what's funny though, man? The doctor told me that I'm six feet tall. I don't believe her. I don't believe her. I I, I don't know why. I just didn't believe her because she just wasn't professional at all. She was kind of like, yeah, whatever. Nice tats. What the fuck, bitch? Do your job first before you compliment my body and shit. But um, <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, I, don't, I don't, I don't believe her. But she said I was six feet tall. But I don't think I am. To be honest with you, I know I'm about five eleven and a half probably. But I'm two forty seven. I know I'm like forty something pounds overweight, forty fifty pounds overweight. You know what I'm saying? Unless I was like all muscle or some shit. But obviously I'm not. So man, I'm gonna try to fucking lose some weight, man. I'm gonna start recording them shits of me like. Doing some sort of workout, I guess, you know, because as long as I'm recording the shit and uploading the shit, y'all can see my fat erode from my body, and then I become a young, a young fucking, you know, um, slim sort of person, then I might get bitches, you know. <laughs> That's what it's all about, right? It's not about me living and all that sort of shit. It's about getting bitches. That's the motivation for most things in this world, get bitches. I don't get flagged because I said the word bitches like 17 times. Standard Saturday. If you have not checked it out, please go buy Lil Dicky's album. It's called Professional Rapper. That shit is baller as fuck. I just listened to it today. I downloaded it. I don't know, man. I'm trying to remember the last time I bought a physical CD. I think the last time I bought a physical CD, like a copy of the shit, was like Eminem. Um. What was the shit called? Uh, relapse. Not yet. Not even recovery, bitch. Relapse. What the fuck? Where's my comb? Alright, probably in my pocket or some shit. Should I get on the expressway? Fuck it. I'm about to get on the expressway. Fuck it. Yeah, like it's going pretty well. Yeah, it's good. Fuck that. I'm not going. Yeah, I was going to go back, but look at that traffic. Fuck that. I'm going home. Fuck this shit. Fuck that. Hey, I have not been to sleep at all, guys. I got home yesterday, played the game for a bit, started doing shit around like, hold on, police right here, so put this shit down real quick. Ah. But I started doing shit like around like, um, something like 12 or something like that. I started playing the game like around 11 and I went to bed at like 20 o'clock and I just sat there the whole time, I never even went to sleep. I just sat there until I had to wake up this morning. I had to wake up this morning at like 6 and leave the house at 7. I just stayed up the whole fucking time like a schmuck. Like a schmuck. You know? That was the weirdest thing ever, man. I, I wanted to show you guys, you know, me driving around toward this tattoo shop, but fuck that. In that traffic, I'm not going to run around in that shit. I mean, y'all wouldn't have to go on the journey, but I damn sure would have to. And fuck that. That shit ain't going now. I think they are just fucking like, you know, I think traffic just exists. 
I'm here in my garage, which is also known as outside. And I just bought this new um, Nissan Sentra. Well, it's not new, but it's new to me. I just got it. It's that YouTube money, man. It's all that YouTube money. I just got this. And then one day you can also have enough money to put down. I mean, you can have enough money to buy it as well. What's up, y'all, man? I just got home and shit. You know, it might not seem that long to y'all. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> because you're watching these shits as I edit them. But to me, that was a long-ass motherfucking draw. You know, but I'm about to go inside the house. Man, I'm about to take a nap, to be honest with y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. I'm about to go to sleep like a motherfucker. I'm just trying to debate though, man. Let, let, let Leave a comment below. Should I make the video, like reviews of the videos that I had to delete? Or should I just pick them up from where I left off? You know what I mean? So just let me know. You know what I mean? Uh, I, if you want me to, I can make reviews of every episode that I've watched and I have and I have since deleted. Or I can just kind of go from where they're at now and just do reviews on those. But let me know, man. That's the kid.